Hello, this is an exploratory video of sorts that I came up with to study the uh, transformation uh, chain from AR tag all the way into valve. I have a, a standard AR tag marker here. I overlay the coordinate system, which is the local coordinate system for this marker, and I derive this straight from the model view matrix. Um, I have here uh, the blue axis is Z, the green axis is uh, Y, and the red axis is X. You can clearly see that X, uh, Z comes out. Y goes across the top of the marker array, and uh, red goes down the side of the marker array. This is clearly in line with Mark Fiala, the author of ARTAG. It's in line with his convention that he uses for all of his .cf or his coordinate files. Uh, down here in the uh, console window, I have a uh, model view matrix that I'm uh, dumping to the console as well as some marker Euler angles. Now, the model view matrix, don't think of it really as uh, row major or column major. Uh, what I did is I took a single dimension array of floats. I gave it to OpenGL. I told OpenGL, populate the array with the model view matrix. So the upper left number in the uh, uh, display there, that is the first element of this array. The number to the right, which is negative 0.999, that is the, the second element. Uh, then the third element, and then that first zero on the upper right is the fourth element. And I just keep dumping left to right, top to bottom, for all 16 elements. Uh, the marker Eulers are derived by uh, giving this um, model view matrix, the rotation component, uh, to a quaternion class and telling the quaternion to give me back its Eulers. So I use the uh, quaternion class included in uh, Ehrlich. So you can see here as I twist the uh, marker, it's roughly parallel to the focal plane. If I twist it about the x-axis, then I get a lot of displacement where it says marker Eulers x. If I twist it about the z-axis, I get a lot of uh, displacement in the z while the others stay stable. And if I twist it in the y, I get a lot of displacement about y. So this is good news. This shows me I know uh, I've got my columns lined up right. I've got the uh, uh, right representation of the matrix and the right understanding of angles. Now I just have to get it into valve. I suspect that we're going to have to do some rotation because here we have z coming out and in the game z is up. 